Hi, I'm Holly. And I'm Brian. In today's video, we're excited to show you some areas of the Central Oregon coast where we traveled near the town of Yahats. We'll check out two bizarre and beautiful coastal rock formations, one that looks like a geyser and the other that looks like a giant sinkhole and is aptly named Thor as well. Then we'll go down the coast and check out the scenic lighthouse of Hasita Head. Here's the one that looks like a geyser. It's called the Spouting Horn. So cool looking. Thor's well is right on the other side, so we'll pan over and show you that now. Here it is from a distance. It looks like the water is disappearing into the rocks. You can see really well in this closer view that the rock is volcanic. It's basalt or hardened lava from a volcano that erupted 37 million years ago. Brian said this sea foam looks kind of gross, but I thought it was pretty intriguing. Thor's Well and the Spouting Horn are near the town of Yahats, which is about three and a half hours drive south of Portland. Just 15 minutes further south is a beautiful lighthouse called Hasita Head, which we'll check out next. The reason for that water dripping over the camera is that we're actually in a cave. The cave is a natural resting area for sea lions, and the entrance has been made into a viewing area. The sea lions weren't in the cave in October, which is when we went, so we'll come back in the winter and cover the sea lion cave in more detail. For now, let's check out the lighthouse. The walk to the lighthouse had these cool spruce trees with Spanish moss. The Lightkeeper's Cottage has been made into a bed and breakfast, which looks like a really cool place to stay. I looked it up online though and it's several hundred dollars a night, so I decided we'd stick with camping. Thanks for joining us on the Oregon coast. Remember to subscribe for more adventures in the Pacific Northwest and beyond.